Consider an example where there are only two massive bodies in a system. Both have the same mass and both are moving toward each other with equal and opposite velocities. Each object has a mass of eight units. The energy of each object is the square root of their masses squared plus their momentum squared, which is equal to 10. The total energy of the system is 10 plus 10, which equals 20. The total momentum of the system is zero since the momentums of each individual object are equal and opposite. Thus, if we calculate the mass of the system of objects, we get a mass equal to the square root of the system energy squared minus the system momentum squared, which gives a value of 20. Thus, the mass of the system of the two objects is 20, but the sum of each mass of the individual objects is 16. There is more mass in the system of objects than in each individual object. Once again, it needs to be emphasized that mass is a system property, and it's not simply additive. What's extraordinary here is that the two masses don't even have to interact with each other. They don't need to collide, and there doesn't need to be a link between them in any way. Yet, when considered as a group together, the system as a whole possesses energy, momentum, and mass as if it was a single object.